Now, here's Chief Meteorologist Tony Petrarca with your Pinpoint Weather 12 forecast. Well, of course, uh, local rivers and streams are high, they're swollen, and fortunately, next several days, I don't see any heavy rain. We may uh, catch a quick you know, flurry or sprinkle or a brief shower tomorrow afternoon, but overall your Wednesday is looking dry as we take a peek down in Narragansett under clear skies, breezy, dry and chilly. And you can see a bit of a wind with the flag in Narragansett. The uh, winds are now anywhere from 20, 25 miles per hour in gusts at times. Oakland Beach and Warwick at the 39 degrees and looking at uh, some breezy conditions that should last through most of the night, but essentially drier weather on tap. No major storms now through Saturday morning, probably even Saturday afternoon. Again, the outside chance of a brief, isolated uh, light rain or snow shower tomorrow afternoon. If that, again, most of your Wednesday is just kind of uh, dry and on the chilly side. But, you know, during the afternoon, I do expect the clouds to take back over and overall kind of a, a brisk and uh, a very cool day. And that next system, as far as any generous rain returning, it's the last thing we need. But right now we're honing in on Saturday night into Sunday morning as far as the next potential for some widespread rain. In the meantime, we are dry. Yesterday's storm system is uh, spinning across Maine right now, gave us that inch to inch and a half of rain, but it was certainly cold enough for all snow in uh, northern New England. On the back side of the, the uh, storm, it's still getting a brisk north and northwesterly wind, but this snow continues across the mountains of Maine, New Hampshire, and Vermont. You guys ready to go skiing? Let's go downhill. Whoa. <laughs> 10, 15, even 20 inches of snow in the mountains of Maine, New Hampshire, and Vermont. And it's still snowing tonight right on through tomorrow. I mean, even locally in our own backyard, Wachusett Mountain and Princeton Mass, they're open. They're, they're skiing there as well. So getting a, a head start on the season. Take a look at the hour by hour forecast, and we're going to start things off at uh, 11 o'clock tonight. And skies are uh, essentially uh, clear to partly cloudy. And again, no, really no major uh, issues as far as precipitation. You'll see a little bit of sunshine in the morning. I do expect uh, the clouds to be taking over during the afternoon hours. And again, just an isolated uh, rain or snow shower during the afternoon. Brisk and kind of chilly, looking at a temperature at around uh, 45. Thursday looks good. I think more in the way of sunshine on Thursday compared to tomorrow. Temperatures, you know, seasonally cool at around 45. You know, weather is looking good on Thursday evening, Thursday night. Three, two, one. Light it up in uh, West Warwick there. The tree lighting has been rescheduled to uh, Thursday evening. It was supposed to be on Monday night, of course. Of course, we had the rainstorm on Main Street at the gazebo in West Warwick. 35 degrees Thursday evening. Weather looking fine for that. Friday, not bad. Now, Saturday day is dry. We're thinking the next chance for rain coming in on Saturday night and extending into at least Sunday morning. It may dry out Sunday afternoon. Milder on Sunday with temps in the mid-50s. We're bringing more rain on Tuesday. Tuesday of next week with uh, temperatures in the lower 40s. Outside of a random rain or snow shower tomorrow afternoon, next several days uh, pretty dry, and that's good news for local rivers and streams. Next chance of any legitimate rain, not until Saturday night. All right. Thank you, Tony. We have